Got paralyzed at 14, hated my life a bit at 19. I, 19M, got paralyzed exactly 5 years ago today. To be more precise, I'm a quadriplegic, I can't move my arms nor legs. Before you ask how I wrote this post, there's this eye tracking gadget that I can use, thank you, modern day technology I got paralyzed when I was partying with my friends. My dumb, sober butt thought it'd be a great idea to try and do a backflip on the ground, it had also rained, so the grass was wet, without any prior experience. Needless to say, I botched my landing and got to spend the next 5 months in a hospital. I've also been in rehab many times and do physiotherapy to this day. Apparently, due to the severity of my injury, much hasn't changed. Now, before my accident, I was a very active guy. I used to go to the gym 5-6 to six times a week, do some sort of a cardio workout almost every day, go swimming or running, and take MMA classes. I had many friends, was good looking, reasonably confident and didn't find interacting with girls too difficult, although my looks boosted my confidence, I was still a bit shy. Today, though, I'm quite fed up with the way my life works. I used to live my life from school days to weekends, but now I live from bowel movement to bowel movement. I can't physically be spontaneous anymore, at least without either pissing or pooping myself. Most of my friends have moved away to continue with their studies or because of work. I feel a bit lonely and although I still live with my family, I can't help but to feel like a massive burden on them. I envy my friends and people who got to spend the latter part of their teenage years like normal teenagers, partying, although I actually wasn't that big of a big party animal, I didn't even drink, forming new friends slash relationships, getting their driver's licenses and discovering the unknown parts of our state slash country and, of course, having intamin. I don't know if it's immature of me to make such a big fuss of not having intimate slash not being intimacy, but I had a high libido even before my accident and although I haven't had a release in 5 years now, the high libido hasn't gone anywhere. I literally used to play some pocket pool every day at least once to keep my thoughts family friendly, you know. I am also a bit sad because I didn't lose my V card back then. I'll never get to feel those sensations nor will I ever be able to give any pleasure, properly, to anyone. I mean I can't use my fingers and although I'd love to give head, the positions would always be the same. So intimate with me will just probably become a boring routine for my potential partner. I'm very insecure and hate the way I am. I'm skinny fat and don't smell that good anymore. I have grown from all the wrong places and shrunk from all the wrong places, if you know what I mean. I would love to have a girlfriend, but who exactly dreams of having an insecure crippled boyfriend who isn't good in bed, poops himself time to time or whose butt you've got to wipe one day. I mean, it's humiliating for both parties. No, I'm also sick of people telling me how brave I am. I know they're trying to cheer me up or something, but I'm definitely not braver than the next person. Sorry y'all, I felt like I needed to vent a bit on my anniversary. Thanks for listening.